guys so in this video i'm going to be teaching you how to make very soft delicious ninja agigi bread keep watching so first you're going to need half a teaspoon of salt half a teaspoon of nutmeg 500 grams of flour 15 grams of yeast 100 grams of granulated sugar 55 grams of butter 100 grams of milk 250 grams of water 2 teaspoons of vanilla and 1 egg Once you've added the salt and nutmeg add the sugar and the yeast and mix thoroughly Preheat the oven to 160 degrees and add the egg and the vanilla and mix and add the milk gradually if you do not have a hand mixer you can use your hands and if you have a stand mixer you could use that instead Add the water gradually. I find that the and mixer does not completely combine the flour to the dough. So I use a combination of my hands and my mixer. Add a bit of water. If you do not have a hand mixer, you need to continue kneading for about five minutes. Set dough aside and apply some butter to your worktop. Flatten the dough. Apply the butter to the center. Then fold. Knead the dough. So this part will not look pleasant but keep kneading so the butter will eventually lock into the dough and become one so keep kneading To make the dough more firm, you need to smack the dough on your worktop. Add the remaining butter 
to the center. You would need to repeat the kneaded and smacking of the dough to give you a firm, soft dough. Continue kneading if you do not have a hand mixer. When your dough looks smooth, then it's time to leave your dough to rise. Cover till it doubles in size. Once it's doubled in size, it's time for you to divide the dough. This recipe can make two loaves of bread. I weigh my dough to make sure I get the equal size bread. Add some butter to your baking tin. This is to ensure that the bread easily comes off after baking. Flatten your dough. Once the dough is flat, you need to roll and press. Roll and press. Roll and press. At this point, you need to pinch the dough to stop it from opening when baking. So pinch it to close the dough together. Once done, you need to roll the dough just very slightly. Then add to the baking tin. You would need to cover until doubled in size. Once it's doubled in size, it's time to bake. And this would be your end result after baking for 10 to 15 minutes. You would have this luscious, soft, delicious bread. And trust me when I say this bread is delicious. This recipe would have your home smelling like a bakery. Do enjoy your soft, scrumptious, delicious Ninja bread. Bye.